what's going on guys your boy x and today we're doing a ranking of kings episode 19 live reaction so last we left off your boy uh boji was in a bad spot he's over here exhausting himself uh nothing he's doing is touching oaken and by the end of the episode the boy uh kage he lost it and he like transformed into like some big ass shadow venom symbiote looking creature and just swallowed oak and i was like oh shit so i'm um, curious where we're gonna go from there uh but let's go and get started remember though guys for more <coughs> ranking of kings live reaction slash reviews make sure to subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel your boy still trying to get to that 40k so help your boy out if you're new here you're coming often ain't subscribed yet Hit that subscribe button. Also, too, eh, I said I was gonna. I said last. Well, this past weekend, I said I was gonna catch up. Oh, three episodes behind, right? And, and with this one, now only two. So, but we'll get it before the next episode for sure, a hundred percent. Just let y'all know. All right, about to begin this, guys. In five, four, three, two, one. Let's get. <clears throat> Oh, I was like, um, okay. Would he take him to the lake or something? What a foolish thing to do. What happened? Oh my god! Alright, man. I don't know they didn't kill the boy Kage like that. I know they didn't. Damn, what they got the found the youth over there? What kind of food? Hmm. Yeah, are they gonna explain what happened to the gods? Like... Oh, wait a minute, I just came up with something. What if the devil is technically... A... No, that wouldn't make sense. I was gonna say, what if the devil was like one of the gods at one point or something like that? I there's some more of them. It's interesting. Damn, does this man eyebrows go to his nose? What kind of shit is this? <laughs> Yo! What did they cut her hands? Oh, oh well, yeah, that's how the doll was. They cut her hands off, they tore her face off. What did they think was gonna happen? <laughs> you laughing? You laughing now? <laughs> we just wanna be happy. Holy shit! <laughs> he ain't sparing no children today. Uh, I guess I guess he's about to put her out of her misery right there, but he couldn't bring himself to do it. I Was that the body parts of the people in the village? What, what was that? Well, she healed, I guess.
ボイスです。私はボッジ様に求めてます。そうだか。お前のボッジって。<笑>God, ain't no way, ain't no way. And then this fool just sits down and starts watching. Ain't no way. We need the healer. Where's the queen at? She ain't got no damn potions right now. Was that little kid the devil? I didn't even notice that because, like, I know they showed her with a, a kid in the opening, but I could never tell who the hell was she running with. That's interesting. What, what the hell is this? Are、oh, they like in her memories right now? Oh, then his memories. Hmm. Oh, what are they in limbo? I thought about it. Hmm. I need to get that info. Where did you put that money at? d e s p e r where you put that money at? <laughs> He's like, I've had enough of this. Oh shit, I thought he was about to smooth jump in that mud. <laughs> Belly flop. I wonder why she's healing him though. Like, is she like getting compassion thanks to、uh, Data? <laughs> The handsome really don't die. Oh, he remembers now. Oh, man, look at that. The friendship. <laughs> Your life is over.
You know, I thought that wasn't really his mom for a second. I thought, like... Oh, man. Damn. It makes it better that it is his mom, actually. Like, well, the boats are going backwards, so I don't think that's gonna happen. But hey, see you later, Mom. Mm -mm -mm. That boy is about to smooth go over there if it wasn't for her. <laughs> you have the same voice, yes. That's the good, that's the question I want to know. <laughs> She's like, whatever. I don't know, man. She just doesn't seem all too bad at times. Like, it's something... I feel like there's something else going on here, because this isn't making sense. The light. No more dark. Oh, well, her hand came back. Oh, she got her face, too. Wow, little Moran, little Moranjo. Oh, wow. Gone. Funny, I'm sorry. Like she's like, oh, I'm just waiting for you to come over here. I'ma whoop your ass for getting my ass killed. And she's just waiting. That was kind of messed up, though. Yeah. Mm. This guy's what is this drawing? Like, more need more death. This guy has no chill at all. Look at this. Giant snake, Psh, get that out of here. Let me go ahead and slice your other heads off. Oh my god. What the hell is he sucking the blood? This guy is a sicko. Holy shit, I mean, he ate a rat that one episode, but I'm having snake. That's like a gourmet for him now. Going from rat to snake, holy shit. Oh shit, this one came in and cut this fool clean in half! Let me see this regeneration now. I mean, we already saw him put his hand back together, so I guess. Sorry if y'all hear it. It's raining in the background, you know. Oh yeah, he's putting this over. Look at this, man. God damn, it is pouring down out there. Oh yeah, the game is all here now, though.
I mean, that's so interesting that she only healed, um, she only healed Kage, but didn't heal Boji. Uh, what? All right, come on, Domus. Let's see what you got. An awful matchup. See, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we knew that, but yeah. Okay. Oh, he cut through one swing. That won't work either, but we'll let you try. Damn, this man be putting blood on oh, blood on everything, huh? And there it goes. Get ready for your tendons to get sliced, cause uh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, okay, and a little two on one. Now we can hop in, guys. We we saw all his techniques. Let's go ahead and whoop his ass. <laughs> what the hell does he think, Bear? Well, he he has been fighting a whole bunch of demon tigers or whatever. So what was it Bear Fist? Boy, boy, four on one. So man, laughing in y'all face. Hold up. Uh oh, oh, what are we doing? Oh shit! What take that? Okay, we eat those. Oh God! Yeah, you're gonna need a fake. You're gonna need to fix that face mask <laughs> again. The big four. Oh, I just noticed that was all of them. Like the big four. <laughs> he's sweating. He's like, oh shit! I'm about to get my ass whooped. This man's over here remembering tactics and shit. Okay. You can become energized. Sword King of the Underworld. <laughs> He's like, huh? Oh, I beat everybody. Quickness. Wait, did. Oh my god, wait a. It's almost like. I don't know if that's just the animation, but it's like he's bending his damn blade on. This <laughs> man's just like, man, hold up, I'm about to. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> oh shit. Can somebody stop? Nobody can stop this man! Like, he just, he just went four on one. Okay, cuz he said that all of a sudden now y'all can get up. Oh, calm down. <sighs> all 
right. So I'm not gonna lie. This, ep- this I think this is actually the first episode that I felt like was fast. Like it just went by. Like not in a bad way. Like I was just like, oh shit, we're at the end already. Um. So. The beginning, right? Uh, Kage, he, you know, did the whole eating of Oaken, but somehow Oaken, I don't even know. We don't even know what all, um, Kage's little inner, I guess, what would you say, inner pocket world or something? We don't even know what that looks like, but basically Oaken just sing, cut his way through. Uh, Kage was basically dead. Basically dead. You had Boja. Ah! I was pretty sad, right? And then Oaken just walked up on him, cut slice. I'm like, this guy is ruthless. But they it, it don't stop there. But anyways, so with Kage, basically, um, well, Despa, I'm sorry, Despa, he was like crawling to them. He's like, no, <laughs> no. And for some reason, Mar- Maranjo, Ram- Ramondo, she ended up uh, possessing, uh, I forgot what that fool's name, but possessing that one guy's body and ends up starting to heal Kage. Now, we go into, like, I guess you would say, like, limbo, maybe, or basically the world, like, in between life and death, right? And you have, like, you have uh, Despa and uh, Boji looking at Kage. He's, like, over here, like, going toward his mom on a boat. And basically, you know, if he crosses over, he can't come back to life. So they're, like, trying to yell and, like, you know, hey, hey, no! But they, he can't hear him. Uh, but Maranjo's there and she ends up there's like a rope connected to the boat she ends up pulling them back or well not pulling them back but holding them at first and she's like you know if you cross over there uh, you won't you know, you you uh you won't you can't come back to life. Isn't there anything that you have here that you you still want or something like that? She said, and that's when he remembered, you know, Boji, and then he kept saying Boji's name. A little emotional moment, you know. He Boji's crying because he said, it. and then like, so she pulls him back, and we actually do get a nice little moment. Cause at first, I was thinking that um I was thinking that uh Kage's mom was gonna be like an illusion or something like that, uh you know, like just like trying to get you to go to the afterlife type of thing, but it was really his mom i was surprised I was like, oh okay and i do like the fact that she didn't like try to like what, what's the word guilt trip i guess is what i, I want to say like guilt trip or force him to come over there you know because i mean she was like you know like hey you know come on over but then like once he said that he has something that he needs to do like protect boji she was just like oh okay i understand well you gotta do it do what you gotta do um and i'll see you know see you later and then he's just like oh yeah you i'll probably be way older then you probably won't even recognize it. like you know some kind of joke but it was nice that he got to have that moment with his mom and then when like he was going like when she was pulling him back with the robe his mom was like wait can you come close i want to see you i want to see you closer again you know still crying so it was a nice little moment and then when he got back over there, he asked her, because he's like, okay, I know you're Miranja, because I, rem- I recognize your voice, same voice, but why did you say me? And she didn't say why, um, but we do get, uh, and I forgot to, was that at the beginning or in the middle? But through um, Bosi, we do get a little bit more of her backstory, I guess the rest of it, what had happened, because I guess after they killed her mom, uh, they ended up tying her up at the... Um, in, in like the center of the the town or whatever and they and they had her like they cut off her hands and that's when they when they uh, skinned her face or whatever and this fool Bosa just goes on a rampage He's like, just killing boys like he a titan or something and like holy shit and then the one woman was like just please spare my child he seen it he killed everybody he's like man spare your child <laughs> um and Afterwards, it looked like he was about to kill Maranjo, and I'm thinking maybe like just for like a, a you know like a pity death or whatever, just to put her out of her misery. But then he decided not to. He ended up taking her, and he had a bag. I'm guessing it was the a bag of all the the villagers. I, I don't know what was in that bag. It looked like it was body parts in that bag. So he ended up going to like it looked like a mage or whatever. And he, you know, he gave it a girl and he's like, you know, fix her and then here and use a bag or whatever. So, like, yeah, basically, I guess he used some of those body parts in order to, like, put on her or whatnot. 
Uh, so that's pretty much what we got right now. So I can see why they have a close bond, like, or at least both say it feels like they have a, well, not feels, but, you know, they have a close bond, like, after all that, and I guess, like, she stayed with him uh, throughout the years, but I, I, we're still missing a little bit more, because then, after he had saved her, he said something along the lines of, it was my fault, like, you know, um, it wasn't, like, the villagers, is whatever she was mad at, it was, like, me in the end, or something, something like that, he said, so we're still missing something here, on top of that, too. I think when Despa had first like touched her and like we were getting like flashes of her memories she was with a kid like a devil kid which I guess was the devil that we know of right now in this time period maybe it's debatable we don't know yet but the kid did look like the devil almost but like in kid form or whatever so I'm, it's like we're starting to see little pieces almost uh but regardless you know kage comes back to life and it's so funny because like when he leaves and she looks over on the other side of the river she sees <laughs> she sees boji's mom and then she sees her mom now of course yes her mom you know is probably waiting on her or whatever she looked kind of sad but it was so funny seeing boji's mom there because she just looked like she was ready like once you cross this river i'm whooping your ass like <laughs> um but afterwards with that uh, the rest of the episode is pretty, uh, simple, I guess you would say, you know, they're trying to figure out a way to heal Boji, they're like, oh, the queen, she's out of power, or whatever, darn, well, there's another person, they don't say who, if I remember correctly, they don't say who, but they just say, yeah, there's somebody else that can heal Boji, well, then who, <laughs> but, um, so the big four come, and at first, who is it, um, uh, whatchamacallit, the, 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 the main swordsman guy, what the hell, the main swordsman guy, he, uh, that's your right, I can't, I'll always forget his fucking name, uh, oh, I'm sorry, too, the snake, the snake tried to hold his own a little bit with Oaken, and that boy started having a, a snake feast, <laughs> but yeah, the big four come, and they, like, all fight him, at first, it's like, one-on-one, -on -one, and then, like, you know, they're, like, cutting him up and somebody's regenerating and then like it becomes four on one and they're honestly whooping his ass at first for a moment until like he starts getting a flashback of Despa like I guess like training him I think or something along those lines and he's like yes you can get a surge of energy yes if you just believe Oaken the swordsman of the swordsman of the oh, <laughs> swordsman of the outworld <laughs> some shit like that and he just starts going <laughs> the hell so yeah man it doesn't look like anybody is whooping oaken's ass anytime soon like this man is just a threat uh but they break out of that little paralyzed state now like we we are the big four yeah <laughs> I'm like okay right so um curious how they're really gonna beat this guy because like he is whooping everybody's ass every episode oaken is whooping somebody's ass it, it has not failed yet so I'm, I'm i'm curious but yeah that's all guys remember for more ranking of kings live reactions slash reviews make sure that the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel hit the bell to get notified i drop my videos also follow your boy on instagram twitter the discord as well as to come a member of the channel or the subscription box below if you like the video guys like the video comment let your favorite part episode was and as always guys been your boy x and i'm out deuces